My name is John Lines and I'm the head of SCND at Heart of Worcestershire College. Inclusivity is one of the four key values we have at college. And for learners with, with additional needs, that means ensuring that we get you on the right course with the right level of support. And the process that we go through means supporting you right from your application, coming to your interview, organising visits to the college, transition visits to the college. It might mean writing an individual learning plan for you and liaising with our curriculum colleagues to make sure they understand the support that you might need in the classroom. We may also talk to parents and carers um, and also your current or previous school to get some more information about how best to support you when you come to college. Our aim is for every student to succeed when they come to us at college. And that means success and progress against your own individual targets and outcomes. For some learners, that might mean internal progression within the college. For others, it might mean progressing into higher education. For others, it's employment and apprenticeships or even voluntary work and activities through a social care budget, for example. What we want to ensure is that from the time you start with us, to the time that you leave us, we've supported you on that journey and help you for that progression into adulthood. Uh, hello, my name is Debbie Morris. I'm the CRQ leader for learners with additional needs in the base in Worcester. And there's also a leader in Redditch called Sally R Blaster. And I just really like to tell you about the service that we offer here at Heart of Worcester College and some of our amazing facilities. So we have about 86 learners in the base and we offer a range of courses from pre-entry up to level two. All of our courses have the same components, so that's a main qualification, it's English and Maths if the person hasn't achieved their GCSE, work experience and tutorials, and in some of our classes we have this odd thing called RAPA, which means recognising and recording progress and achievement. And basically it's classes where we're not following the criteria of a qualification. It gives us a lot more freedom to look to meet the learners' needs. For me, the key things that we are trying to achieve in the base are to develop learners' independence, to develop their communication skills, and to develop their social skills. We have a great staff team here. As well as our tutors, we've got a great team of learning support assistants that are here for the students all day. So our LSAs are here throughout the day to support learners, to make sure they're having a great experience and really feeling safe at the college. Most of our learners have educational healthcare plans. And again, we make sure that they get reviewed on a yearly basis to make sure that the curriculum is meeting their needs and the support is meeting their needs. Skills to work, one. Can you tell me a little bit about what you do in that course? Um, maths and English, going over, ready for exams. Mm, cookery and um, ICT skills and health and safety, getting about safety. We have been doing CVs, health and social care, teamwork and some other stuff, which is really enjoyable. Good, 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 uh, really good. Good to be like walking since I've been here, feel like I've been here for ages. English, see my mates and the teachers and um, Debbie Morris. In sporting with um, teachers and the LSAs. I like everything about the course. It's probably one of the best courses in this college. Yes, I am in a uh, charity shop called Cancer Research UK. I have been there for the last 18 months and it's been really good. Yeah, definitely. I would definitely recommend the course. You have so many nice teachers and so, so much work that is really good. You will learn a lot in life about it. For further information about how we support learners with additional needs at Heart of Worcestershire College, please go to our website. There's lots of further information on there and some key contact details on there. And hopefully that will provide you with all the information you need or feel free to contact us.